Hi everyone, Jamie Geller here and Eitan Burnett. No, Chef Eitan <laughs> Burnett. I got a celebrity in the house today and we're making something special. This is like a great brunch you can make mm -hmm. for your mom. Mm, definitely. Any day of the week. Mm -hmm. Or Mother's Day or Sunday. Like it always works. Mm -hmm. So we've got a nice great avocado here. We want to mm -hmm. go lengthwise against the pit. So you want to take a nice sharp knife, mm -hmm. hit the pit. And then we just want to follow the pit as our guide all the way around so we meet right where we began. And that's how you get a nice, perfect slice. Now I can perfect. already see. This is wrist mm -hmm. of the wrist. Perfect. With a beautiful avocado. Oh. It picked out the perfect avocados. I want to do a little bit of a light greasing. I have extra virgin olive oil here, mm -hmm. EVOO, which I use for everything. Mm -hmm. Let's do a little quick grease of the bottom of our casserole dish. And what are you doing now? You've got a lot of great, exciting things going so, on. So short term, like what I'm doing right now, I'm very busy with my food blog, cookwithchefetan.com. Mm -hmm. So I know, so I do my photography. You take gorgeous pictures. Thank you. And we fe featured a lot of Eitan's recipes and photos on joyofkosher.com. Mm -hmm. And we've got another special one yeah. coming up for everyone. A little, little sneak So I think there. that's like short term work on my blog right uh -huh. now. I definitely have some cool long term ideas that cool different things like that. But right. that's like what I'm doing right now. Right now. So a little bit of salt and pepper. I always use kosher salt, Eitan. Yeah, it brings out the flavor of the dish. It's mm -hmm. the salt, it's the chef's salt. Mm -hmm. So you know, every chef worth his weight in salt has kosher salt, and it's not gonna make your food taste salty, but it's gonna enhance the flavor. Mm -hmm. Can you give me a little fresh a cracked little black pepper? Pepper. Yeah, I love pepper. Great. So you ready to get your hands a little bit dirty? All right, let's go. Okay, so you help me with the eggs. We've gotta fill four of them. Mm -hmm. One for you, one for me. In we go. Perfect. Okay, you want to try with the bottle? Sure. Oh, I forgot that part. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Gentle. Great. Now plop it in right. So, there. that is beautiful. So we season the avocado because mm -hmm. it needs something to bring out that flavor. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to season the eggs as well. So you want to hit it again more. with the pepper? Sure. I got the little bit of salt on the eggs. We can go together. It's like a free-for-all. And I like a little bit of red pepper flakes on here. I love red pepper flakes. I can't take it. We did not plan this. We did not plan this. Okay, so this is great. Some red pepper flakes on there. It's Beautiful. like super colorful and a little heat. And flavorful. We love it spicy in our house. Now this goes into a preheated oven at 350 degrees, mm -hmm. 15 to 20 minutes. A little less if you like runny yolks, a little mm -hmm. more if you like your yolks firm and set. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's bring this over here. Great, careful, it's hot. All right. Okay, great. So we're making a little tomato basil salad mm. to go along with our avocado egg boats. Mm -hmm. So one of my tips is I have the basil soaking in water mm -hmm. over here that keeps it nice and fresh. You can keep it in your fridge like that. Mm -hmm. I adore basil. What are your thoughts on basil? Like yeah, that? I love basil. We actually grow it every year in our garden. Oh, so it's like, just like walk out the front door I and love get it. some basil. This smell is intoxicating. It's one yeah. of my favorite herbs. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna roll it up mm -hmm. like a cigar, nice and tight. Keep my fingers in and give it a nice thin slice. Okay, when I pass me the bowl, there you, go. If you don't mind, thank you. We'll start with that because I'm gonna also garnish with a little bit of uh, fresh, uh, like I said, the small little basil leaves at the very end. Now, again, we're gonna hit it up with a little kosher salt mm -hmm. to bring out the flavor of those beautiful tomatoes. And where's our pepper, Eitan? Pepper right over here. Yeah. Okay. Tell me where you want to be five, ten years down the line. So I definitely think, um, I think like since I've started cooking and mm -hmm. since like I was on chop and everything, I definitely would say that it's changed. Like uh -huh. it's kind of what I wanted to evolve. Like I learned I, like, I really don't necessarily want to be in the back of a restaurant. All okay, day long. that's a good thing to know. I'm going to um, hit it with a little EVOO while mm -hmm. you talk. Like who predict I'd be cooking with Jamie? Tonight. Totally. I, I to me, I, this was like written in the stars. This was so exciting for me. So we give this a little bit of a mix. And I'm gonna hit it with some Parmesan cheese. Oh, that's yummy. so. How cute is this, by the yeah, way? I know. I love it. I love it. So on um, Shabbos, when I need something that's parv, that's when I go garlic mm -hmm. or red onion or scallions. You know, whatever I've got going on. Mm -hmm. uh, even some chopped shallots. But today it's my lucky day, mm -hmm. I'm going parm. Now I love shaves of Parmesan cheese, like fresh mm -hmm. long shavings, and I'm just gonna give them like a rough chop, because I don't want shredded mm -hmm. parm, I really want that like sharp little, little bites of flavor. Mm -hmm. So just like a kind of boom boom like that, mm -hmm. and that hits in there, and you wanna give it a little mix. And that to me is like heaven oh. in a bowl. It looks so good. Yeah, okay, looking good. All right, let's get the eggs out of the oven. 
Ooh, look at those. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Oh, this is great. Good. We've got like two runny and two set. Mm -hmm. So depending how you Whoever like them. likes it. Yeah, baby. That looks good. Right, Eitan? Like, do we love this or do we love this? Mm -hmm. We haven't even tasted it yet. Yeah. Let's get some salad on the plate. It smells so good. It's incredible. And then now we're putting a little bit of our tomato basil parm salad on the <clears> side. <throat> Want to hit it with a little bit of cracked black pepper for me? Sure. You know how I love my pepper. And then we've got a few little baby basil leaves. Oh, how about pick some yeah. of those off and let's put them everywhere. And even just on top of the, uh, our little avocado egg boats also, and a little drizzle of EVOO. Mm-hmm. My fave. And I think we're ready to eat. The recipes are on joyofkosher.com. You can find out more of Chef Eitan at cookwithchefeitan.com. And we do a lot of fun things together. We have Facebook Lives, we have other videos, mm -hmm. and it's just the beginning of a long and prosperous uh, working relationship, Chef yeah. Eitan. This is fun. Mm. Mm. The basil with the parm, mm. with the tomatoes. Good. There's like, what else is there to say? What? Not too much. No, okay, no, we gotta no. try the avocado egg boats. I feel like I need a spoon for that. What do you think? I'll use a fork. Oh, I'm, look, it's oozy. The yolk is nice mm -hmm. and runny in the middle. The avocado. I want to get a little bit of this on it. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh my gosh, if I do say so myself. Mmm. So creamy. Mm -hmm. The avocado and the yolk is so creamy. We've got a little bit of heat from the cayenne. Mm -hmm. That's how you build a bite. That's how you build a bite. That's good. Check us out, joyofkosher.com. Mm.